So far, yeah, like it's got just enough bitterness, mm. nice and balanced, good body on the lips, yeah, little chocolate also, a little bit of chocolate, mm. good color, yeah, it's a beautiful color as well. Mm. Kind of the perfect blends, more body, yeah, more easy body, yeah. Strong. This is more dark. Is it the rose that's darker or yes, is it the rose? Yes. The rose one's a bit darker. This is the darkest one. Yeah. Okay. Deep. Ooh, you you can feel it for the different. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. It looks like shot. Shot the 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 don't shock it, all right? Cheers. This one's for yoga tapping. Yeah. <laughs> 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 there is yoga traffic. It's a lot. It's really smart the roast. Not so earthy, bitter. Nice. I like this one, it's stronger. It's got quite a strong body as well. I will like it. it Taste the difference in the rose, it's good though. One, this is Guji. So we're getting Guji in Guji. Quite a strong roast as well. A little bit earthy too. Super bitter. Not sure if I'm loving the bitter. Kind of earthy as well. Strong aftertaste. Mm, don't love this one as much. This one's not one of my favorites. This one's Macaclinia for me. Don't be stirred. It's not even hot. It is hot. Cheers, biggest. Cheers. The mocha flavor. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to keep this appropriate for all ages, guys, so please behave. 
So Harar is in the east of Ethiopia. It's very, very distinct in terms of coffee origins because most of the other coffee in Ethiopia is grown in the west and the south. There's a very rich mocha flavor and uh, we're really excited to try it. But this is our final taste. This is Harar. I'm expecting this one to be really cool because everybody in Harar is very cool. So this should be the coolest coffee. Matt, you're a professional coffee pourer. Wait, So funny. Timmy, is the caffeine kicked in already? Yes. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. 10 shots of coffee first thing in the morning. <laughs> and I had coffee from home too. Nice. Okay. It's gonna do that to you. Yeah. Oh. Okay, Matt is serving us now. Yeah. Nice. Thank you. Ladies first. Mm. Yeah, me too. I'm trying to keep the camera steady, but the caffeine is uh, <laughs> making it hard. Wait, 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 wait. Whoa, gee. Take it back, take it again. Other hand. Is it adrenaline in or is it caffeine? Coffee. In the jungle. <coughs> so everybody cheers for hurrah. Cheers, cheers. Hurrah for hurrah. Hurrah for hurrah. Nice. And <laughs> This is really different. Strong. Strong. Oh, different. Yeah. It's nice. I like it. Earthy. Again. Oh, yeah. I like this taste. Yeah. A little bit sweet as well. Good mocha flavor, a little bit sweet. I like it. I got like a fountain. In the back of your head. Yeah, I like it still. You like it, Cat? One of the best aromas. Bonjour. Nice. Yeah, I have some awesome. That's a re really unique one. It doesn't taste like anything. Yeah. I like it. I like it. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay, so that's the end of our coffee tasting experience. I'm feeling a little bit caffeine elated, but it was really, really cool. I definitely recommend anybody and everybody who is in Addis to come to Wild Cafe, Wild Coffee, and experience all the different flavors from all the different regions in Ethiopia. It's definitely worth it. it I'll post a link in the location where it is in this area. Thanks.